Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? Say yes. Say he is cool, mini axe. He said, he said no. Do you not like bugs? Are bugs gross? Do they creep you out? Yep, that was a nod. Welcome, guys. It is the Axeman here, and we are back on Ark Survival Evolved with some more -la 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 burst. Yeah, boy, we're just chilling here with Cupcake and Miniax, who's staring at my crotch for some reason. Miniax, can we, like, not do that? Don't do that. Don't, oh. Oh, maybe this is how I keep breaking my rug. I keep punching it. Ah, uh, okay, that makes sense. Oh, I did wonder why that thing's always damaged. Interesting. <laughs> Anyways, what we are going to be doing today is... You see that little bum all over there? See that butthole face? We're going to be taming this dude. So, we tamed that, what, uh, a week or two ago. I struggled a little. Actually, no, I take, I take that back. I struggled a lot taming this. It was my first, like, time taming one with, you know, reduced race, more closer to official. I know, obviously, not at, at official race, but you know what I mean, like... Yeah, this was difficult. We lost... It was 180, I believe. We lost, what, a good 10 levels on it. But we persevered, and we did get one in the end. Kind of do like the colours on it. He's pretty decent as well. And, uh, yeah, Jim tamed a female one uh, a week or so ago, actually. I think he had a little bit of issue like I did, but I think he did a little bit better. So his one, who I also believe was a 180 should have a couple more levels but what i want to do i want to breed them together because i i'm not taming another one of them ever again um i want to breed it up get a get the imprint uh i don't think we'll get mutations maybe we will who knows but i want to see how good that actually is and then we're going to compare it to like the indominus rex the giga maybe even me spino me rex obviously it's not going to have all the mutations because we're not doing a full-on 100 mutations into melee but i do want to kind of just compare see where it would fit into the if it was like to make a tier list of uh, all of the big apex creatures so um yeah that's all we're gonna do we're gonna go head over um i know we killed jim not too long ago but we did luckily save all of his stuff so we can go and retrieve his cadontosaurus we'll check uh oh actually should we take bomol with us because then we can actually check the stats and compare them and see if uh who got the better one so but old face you might as well come with me can i get you from here not admin mode axe <laughs> there we go good stuff all right let's go to jim's box <laughs> let's get his creature uh and yeah then we can compare them together okay before we enter jim's house then i guess uh, let, let the man speak for himself this is definitely jim just here then so he jim's saying if you like the video make sure you whack in a like make sure you subscribe and you ring the bell and every notifications following the social medias if you want to support the channel that little bit more you can become a channel member or a patron you do get uh, an exclusive video every single week every single friday a video that only members and patreon can see so if you want some extra content you want to support the channel then uh head on over there um oh evo you're still sleeping in here Oh, has no one actually been online this long? Boys, you are slacking. Am I stuck on this stupid kitty again? There we go. Cool. All right. So in here, this is all the stuff he had on his body. There should be a Cadontosaurus somewhere. He has a Dodic. He has a bird. The Mona Lisa. Uh, he has a beaver. He has loads of, like, gathering dinos in Anki. He's got a trike? Why has he got a level 76 trike? You know what? We're not going to question it. Um, where is... Uh, oh, here it is. All right. Cool. Ooh. I don't think his was the best, actually. What we'll probably do is we'll breed these a bunch of times and give him, like, an egg. Uh, I think he did that for us with the Ceratosaurus. But, yeah, we had 42 health, 37 melee. Oh, yeah, his sucks. He has better stam, which is probably the only thing we really care about. Wait a minute. Hang on. I'm just looking at their health. Are these the same creatures? Oh. Oh, hang on. We might have an issue. Oh, we might have an issue here. Okay, so I was well confused. If we're looking at this dude's health, 18 thousand health now i've not put any level actually i've put 10 levels into melee whereas jim's only has seven thousand so i have eleven thousand more health which makes zero sense what level did yours come out at a two four three oh mine was way better than his jim you're sucked and you've we already put 30 levels into it but we've got a bigger problem this is a paleo one 
We're a regular one. I don't think these can even breed. So we got 69% tame and effectiveness. Jim got 37. God damn, Jim, you've ruined this whole episode. Wow, that really sucks. Okay, uh, let me just throw them both out because I don't know if they're going to be able to breed because technically they're different creatures, right? Um, They're not mate boosted at all. Oh, I didn't know mine was a normal one. I thought I had a paleo one. What is what's the difference? Is mine even is mine bigger? Is that why Jim like didn't struggle as much? Because his was just a regular uh, mine was a regular. And the paleo one might be easier to tame. Oh. Interesting. Alright, so if I was just to do mating. Let's just see here. Do do they do anything? Mine is so much bigger than yours, Jim. Holy crap. I know people say size doesn't matter, but size definitely matters here. Okay, well, that has thrown a massive spanner into my work. That is something we should have probably checked before. Wow. Them stat differences are insane. I'm going to guess the Paleo one was a smaller one made to be tamed a little bit easier. 222 melee. He's already put 30 levels into his and he's got 200. Wow. Okay. Maybe we are taming another one today. Oh, uh, what, what if I don't want to? Okay, right. I'll tell you what we're going to do. Maybe we are taming another one. I'm trying to think because we can definitely a thousand percent. Like, obviously, I looked at all the comments in the videos everyone's like suggestions um hints and tips and all that stuff and everyone said when we was doing the babies like feeding him the babies that was the way to go uh we just needed more weight on ourselves to carry bigger stuff uh right i'm just thinking first off i've got to find a high level female standard car char uh and then we tame it we drop loads of babies out it eats all of them Oh, this, I really don't want to have to do this because I just had such a terrible time last time. But I feel like I'm already invested. I'll tell you what. We'll fly around. If we find a decent level one, we'll tame it. How about that? If we don't, then maybe we can move on to the Arthros. Because I do want to get us an Arthro and maybe we can do a car char the other day. Because I'm kind of semi-invested now and after seeing how good our one is maybe we do need to get us another one maybe what i need to do is yeah find us a really high level one maybe do some googling and watching some youtube videos on like the best way to tame it i do feel like using like babies might be the best idea i'll tell you what in the comments let me know the best way to tame a codontosaurus Maybe you've done it on, like, official and you're a pro at this and you don't lose any taming effectiveness. Because what I'm thinking, you get you throw loads of babies out just before you tame it, put them all on passive, you eat all of them, you take no damage, you're all good, right? Trap-wise, do we do a trap, do we not do a trap? Let me know in the comments and we'll definitely get that sorted, you know, in the in this week at some point. I think that's something we can work towards. Um, all right, I did not see any Cardantosauruses over there. Actually, whilst I'm here... <laughs> I'm actually also just going to check this red drop down here. I did grab it this morning, but we're going to go see if another one spawned in. I got us like a really good mining helmet, but I definitely want more armors or saddles or something. So boom, and another mining helmet and some pants. Amazing. Well, we could definitely go mining at some point. We've got a 7-11 one there. There we are. Look at that. Cool. And uh, you get a little spotlight. Amazing. We could use that in the cave at some point, I'm sure. All right, let's go see if we can find uh, another Arthro then. Because, yeah, I still want to get a, an imprinted one of them. I still, I just want to breed some Arthros. I just want to see what's they, uh, what they look like. Uh, do we have my Arthro on me? Uh, we have a male. Okay, so we're looking for a female. Uh, we don't have any stuff on us, but we're just going to look, see if we can find a level. So male, 114... Um, we should probably kill you. Uh, there's another one. That's a level six. Was that really a level six? That is the lowest level creature you can find in the game for our difficulty. That is some dog shit. <laughs> um, any other Arthros? 
Okay, this is going to be a pain, isn't it? I guess we'll take a fly down here, just around here. And then before we go home, I actually take a fly over to the mountains to see if there's any Kodontosaurus up top there, just in case. Could be a 180 female waiting for us. And then we know we need to get a move on to tame that. Uh, is there really no Arthros around here? Arthros, 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 Arthros. We could head into the cave to find one, but that could be a really bad idea. Um, all right, I'm not seeing any just yet. Okay, what we'll do, let's go have a look over this mountain. Let's see if we can find any Codonosauruses. And then what I can do is we'll probably get on Grapevine, clear out that area, maybe like, you know, start running across it. And I'll keep going until we find us a, a female. So this is, I don't know what I want to call this, but this is like Apex Mountain. So as you can see already, we have a, a 162 Giga. Nice. We also have a Rex. You normally have like at least two Gigas up here. Even sometimes two Gigas, a Codonosaurus, and a Rex. Um, that's like as chill as it's ever looked. Uh, oh, maybe that Giga was up there. Oh, yeah, there's two more Gigas. Yeah, just this area is just full of stuff. So we had 162, 156... What were you? 24. All right. A couple of good gigas. And then just further down, I want to say nine times out of ten. Yep, there we go. There's a Codontosaurus. Now, are you a normal or are you a paleo? So you're a paleo 66. Interesting. Okay. Is there any more? I kind of want to kill that one. Just in case it gives us a better one. Let me just make sure there's no more around here. Uh, oh, actually, there's also... There's one more spot I'm going to look after this. There's also the volcano area, which I always forget that a bunch of them spawn as well. All right, let's quickly go kill this Codontosaurus. Uh, is that a loot box thing? Do you have loot? Is it a red one? Do you have any loot at all? Uh, no, can I take that sword? I feel like that sword would be pretty cool. All right, what do we want to use to fight Mr. Codontosaurus? Uh, we do have... You know what? We have the Indoraptor, which we uh, bred up the other day. Let's use you. All right. Stand up. Oh, you got some levels. Uh, let's do all melee. So this is the one that had a bunch of mutations in. And we never really got to try it out with the UTF. So here we go. Uh, 369. It only does 39 damage to us. Okay. There we go. What have we got down here? Is there an Alpha Raptor here? So 700. Oh! I forgot. D -d 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 yep. I forgot Stegos did that. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, help. Oh, help. Oh, help. Oh, please kill the raptor. Please kill the raptor. You're doing a great job, Mr. Indo Raptor. I forgot about Stegos and their, you know, their stuff. There we go. Hey, I killed it. Ha <laughs> ha. Get shit on. Nice. All right. There's also a, an Alpha Connor there. May as well kill that as well. Hello, sir. It's coming up to uh, beat you up. So, yeah, 738. That's really not bad. Okay, Mr. Raptor, you get involved. Cool. You're dead. Now, we've still got, well, I don't know, maybe another 30, maybe even more, like, mutations to put into melee on this dude before we level it up properly as well. I feel like this dude's going to be an absolute beast. There we go. There's you, dead. Nice. Uh, okay, so definitely need some of that. Boom, there's some melee. Have some more melee. You're just going to go all melee. All right, let's just quickly test you out. So this is <laughs> this is kind of, you know, where we're at with the Indoraptor right now. 879. Good shit. Okay, that's a little tester for you. We're just doing bits and bobs today, apparently. I had a whole episode set out, which I'm going to blame Jim on ruining because he tamed the wrong Codontosaurus. Um, oh, was that one? He won... You a Rex. What are you? Hang on. Uh, I think he was just... Yeah, he was just Rex. Okay, my bad. Um, yeah, don't know what I was saying then. So the last little area we're just going to check right in front of us, just near the Wyvern Trench. Uh, Gigas spawn there. Codonosaurus is spawn there every now and then. They're not as, like, uh, common as the Gigas. Uh, just, like, around here. Or maybe over this way. Uh, I mean, I say they're not the common. There's one just there. There's a Giga and everything. Okay, there's all sorts. Hang on. Oh, yeah, there, there's just everything we want. Okay, 18 Giga, 24 Giga. Hidontosaurus, uh, 54 normal one. Good shit. Level 30 Giga. Okay, I kind of want to fight all of this as well. What was that last one over there? Ooh, 174. 
Um, I don't have tea and crumpets on me, do I? Maybe I shouldn't be fighting all of them. Okay. Maybe we leave that for now. I do really want to get that that Kodonosaurus. Is that another Kodonosaurus? There is. Oh, this is the spot. Well, that's a Paleo one. That's a Paleo 72. Um, all right. I'll tell you what we'll do. We're going to get us an off row first. I think to finish the episode off, we'll come back here with Team Crumpets and kill all of that. In hopes that that spawns some better stuff. Okay, right. Let me go. I need to empty my inventory. I need to just go back home, clear some stuff. Um, I'll bring it back once we find a decent level female Arthro. We'll tame that up. We'll breed that up. We'll have a look at what the eggs and the babies look like and stuff. Get a nice imprint. Test that out. Then Team Crumpets is going to kill some stuff. How about that? That sounds like a decent thing to do. Can we do a backflip in celebration? Because I'm so excited. Hey, let's go. All right, we're back. And we have found uh, what we're looking for, sort of. Um, <laughs> let me go show you. I've been fighting a couple of afros. Um, they, they've broken me shirt and stuff. So we're, we're a little bit naked, but that's fine. So up here, there's a small gaggle. A small gaggle of afros. Uh, are you a new one? Which one are you? Uh, you're a 114, so we don't care about you. Okay, we'll, we'll kill you anyway. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, get rid of you. Up this way somewhere. Uh, I think it's this one. Look at this. Are you ready? Boom. Max level male. But guess what we need? A female. <laughs> so there is... Oh, Jesus. Hello, sir. That was terrifying. So um, yeah, there, there's, there's a max level. Uh, not the creature or the gender we're looking for, unfortunately. However, there was another one. I think it might be you. Uh, this is a female and it's 168. So uh, I think that's about as good as we're going to get. I would prefer a 180 or a 174, but I don't know. I feel like I've killed a bunch of these and we don't care about the level too much. I'm kind of just here to see... You know, what they're all about, really. Uh, how are we meant to kill you when you're both going to be, like, inside of each other and stuff? Uh, I guess I can shoot you, right? Don't you take more damage from bullets? Yep, there we go. There's the 180 dead. All right, now we need to unaggro from this one. And then we can tame it. But, uh, yeah, 168, that kind of works. I don't mind too much. It's a shame the 180 had a penis. I wish we could have just ripped that off. Uh, is that another one down there, or is that a snake? Uh, okay, 114 female. That's okay. All right. Uh, I think that dude must have de -aggroed. Can you get out of here, bugs? Uh, oh, Jesus. Okay, right. Everyone, chill. I'm out here looking for... Oh, froze. Uh, let me just... Can we climb up here? Very fine. All right. Can anyone see an Arthro moving anywhere? What the heck? Oh, is that you? Bro, you blend in. Yeah, okay. Can you, like, unaggro? Is that something that can happen? It's still following us. Okay, I guess we run all the way out of render and come back and get it. Is that better? I can see you up there. Right? Is that you? You're not following me anymore? Okay, good shit. Right. Um, so, we're going to make sure there's no one around. We're going to pop on our bug repellent. Uh, oh, we're also going to put a ghillie suit on as well. Are we all safe here? I think we should be. Okay, cool. So, uh, all of this on. This on. We've got me parrot as well. You bugger off, Mr. Bird. You just chill there. All right, so I've got me broth of enlightenment in the last slot. Should be straight up insta tame. Where did you go? Are you up here? How have I lost you again? Where? <laughs> Where'd you go? Oh, is that you just there? Okay, cool. D wait, let me just check. That is you, right? Uh, boom, 168. Okay, cool. Right, we've got to make sure we get into the middle of you. And boom. There we go, boys. Nice. Okay, that was nice and easy. All right, what we thinking for stats? So let's bring you down here. Obviously, this is a high level. Just remember that. Can I move this down here so they move up? So we had 42 melee, 35 health. The female has 46 melee. God damn. Okay. 46 melee. And then it's got more health. The female's better. 
Uh, weight. It has better. The female's way better. What do you even have low in? He has more. He has more oxygen and food. Okay, goddamn. See, that's why, you know, sometimes you settle for the 168. Uh, where's my team? Grapevine? God, it's just so dark, I can't see what's going on. Sometimes, even like, I don't know, just settle for the 168 because it can have better stats than a max level one. Wow. Okay, that's kind of sick. Right. What we're going to do now is I'm going to get me bearings because I am just all over the place right now. <laughs> we're going to go back to the castle. We're going to breed these. I don't think I've ever bred Arthros, so I have no idea what the babies look like. I'm going to guess they're going to be small and skinny and disgusting. But I kind of want to see what their eggs and all that stuff looks like. So, um, yeah, let's get to it. Okay, then. So, Arthro number uno. Arthro number dos. Is it? I don't know. <laughs> here we go. Here's our two Arthros then. So, male, female. You're not like a paleo version or something like dumb like that, right? Mating. Uh, mating. They're doing it. The insects are doing it. How do insects even breed? I don't know. Is that something I want to Google? I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't Google that. I'm going to guess they just like... What's that stuff where they just like breed themselves? They turn into female or produce eggs and sperm at the same time? I don't know. Anyways, it's happening. <laughs> That's all that matters. So, do you drop like an egg? And where would it come out? Where's where's your butthole? 92, 95, 99. Oh. Oh, it's one of them weird looking eggs. Um, That's hatching fast. Is that thing going to pick it up? Dodo? Can you pick this egg up? I mean, it's, it's, it's going. Oh, no, there you go. You pick it up. Oh, so is it... Get out the way, hand of an indom. Is the egg in there? Oh, yeah, look. I mean, it's hard to see because I've still got this stupid bug repellent on there. But you can see the eggs in there. Ew, they all look gooey and, like, they're, they're pulsating. Ew, that's gross. Okay, what I'm going to do is be stuck on just everyone's fingers. We're going to let them breed a bunch of times. We'll then hatch out all the eggs and, obviously, we'll try and get one with the best stats possible. We're not going to get any mutations on these, I don't think. I don't care from that much, unless they turn out to be really, really cool. Um, but yeah, I mean, they're, they're just Arthros. If we was using these for PvP, maybe we'd go for mutations, but I kind of just wanted to breed some insects, to be fair. All right, uh, let's just wait here for a, a little while, maybe when this bug repellent is gone, and then we'll hatch all the eggs together. All right, that's way better. I can actually see and stuff now. So yeah, there's the weird pulsating eggs, if you wanted a closer look at that. So you should be able to drop all of these. Absolute disgusting sound or whatever that was that was weird that sounded like fireworks um all right sweet so this is what we got so not the greatest only lost a bit of uh, weight which is not bad lost a bunch of stuff lost a bunch of stuff did get a mutation into weight amazing lost a bunch of stuff also lost 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 i mean we could keep going until we get a perfect one should we go a little longer? You know, I'm going to go a little longer. I kind of, you know, I just want it. I just want that perfect one. All right, this is the last batch we're going to cook because, um, yeah, I, I'm not getting any luck and I don't want to sit here all day and wait for eggs. Uh, we can still use that one that loses one point into weight if we need to, but we've got 56 to pick from right now. So I think we was around this way. You know what? We could probably sort them into, I don't know. It'd be nice if we could sort them into, like, whichever one has the best. Or the highest level, I guess. I don't know. All right. So, any luck with these bad boys? Remember, we have the one that loses one point into weight, which is really not that bad because weight's already at 41. That loses one into movement speed, so that's actually the best one so far. Definitely use that one. Did we really not get any, like, perfect ones from this? Because that sucks. Booty cheeks, man. Uh, we did not. So, uh, 55, 56 attempts. Okay. It is what it is. That's cool. Uh, we can actually destroy all of them. Don't need them right now. We'll get a better one at some point if we need to. All right. Six. So, uh, you guys can stop breeding now. Uh, let's do disable and disable for you. Okay. Let's have a look. Uh, can we have a floor that's not glitching out? Let's have a look at what the baby looks like out here. So... Small, 
tiny centipede. Here we go. Um, oh, oh, he's chunky. <gasps> look at him. I mean, it's gross, but look how chunky and stubby he is. Oh, he's a little chode. Oh, he's amazing. Oh, he does kind of have a weird resemblance to a penis, sort of. Yeah, the head's weird. Mmm, yep. Okay. That's kind of cool. Look how small and chunky he is. I thought he'd be, like, really, really skinny and long. He's the small and chunky. Look at me, the axe. Look, it's a little bug. Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? Say yes. Say he is cool, mini axe. He said, he said no. Do you not like bugs? Are bugs gross? Do they creep you out? Yep, that was a nod. Okay, Miniax doesn't like bugs. I guess we'll put this dude away. <laughs> uh, we'll go and raise him um, in here. We'll get it raised up then. Get him imprinted. Um, he didn't have any mutations, or it did it? I don't think it did. No, zero. Just lost that one point into movement speed. So he's got 36 health, 46 into melee, 41 into the weight as well. <laughs> Nearly 50 points is oxygen, so we're going to be a swimmer. Uh, okay, I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, here we are then. So, our fro, um is ready to go. I don't know why I came down this way. I should have been where there was things to actually fight. Um, Maronotops, you... Oh, there's, there's a scorpion over there. Would you fight me? Can I get your attention? Yeah. Come over here, because, like, you're, you're ganged up here, right? So, 171 damage. That's really not that bad. Uh, 115 when they've got their mate boost. Uh, he's doing a little bit of damage to us. We do three to six every time they bite us. Okay. I mean, it's not the worst. Can I spit at you? Oh, I did get him. 184 with a spit. Uh, can I finish you off? Hey, yeah. Shot in the bum. Nice. All right. Uh, we've got two levels from that. Let's do... Let's do a bit of melee. So that's four nines there. Hello, Mr. Scorpion. Do you want to fight me? Oh, God. Look at this thing. Just the sounds we make. Oh, I don't like looking at the feet. Nope, the feet are gross. Don't like that at all. So 177. I mean, that's... That's good. That's really not bad, like, at all. Oh, no, I really don't like that. Ugh, that, like, ugh. It gives me the shivers, man. <laughs> really don't like that at all. Um, all right, is there any more creatures around here? Hello, creatures. Is there anyone around here? All right, let's go... <laughs> You're, you're, you're not the fastest. Um, where is Grapevine? Let's go find... Find, like, a bunch of creatures to fight. Uh, it's got Snake. Is there anything more than just Snake? I mean, there's loads of in, uh, loads of fish. I'm gonna go fight loads of fish. This is where we tamed the Afro. Hello? Any creatures to fight? Afro, Smilodon. There's a couple of Afros there. You know what? Screw it. Let's do that. All right. Boom. Pop you away. Afro. Let's go. You watch this be a 180 female down there. Not that it matters because we got a good one, but let's check. An 18 and a 114. Good stuff. All right. Can I spit at you? Hey, yeah. I spit at you before you spit at me. I tried to dodge it. Hey, yeah. Oh, oh, that's not good. Um. Okay, trying to turn. Hey, yeah. Let's go. So I do 107. God damn it. I just repaired my shirt. That's annoying. Uh, okay. Hey, yeah. Okay. Cool. Amazing stuff. Great fight in here. You're going to spit at me. You're going to break from his shit. Cool. Now I'm naked. I literally just repaired this before I came out. Broke it all. God, I hate Arthro sometimes. It's fine. You know what? I, I like being in my underwear. It's more comfortable, if anything. I, you know what? The breeze. It, it just feels nice. That That's what I wanted. Okay, so 191, 177. Yeah. We're not a bad little dude. I just wish I had someone's base I could break down. <laughs> we can see how much damage we do to structures. Uh, we're also not on the saddle properly, right? Why are we, like, off to the side? What is my guy's problem? Do you just not know how to ride a creature? Let's try that again. Is that better? There we go. I mean, my hands aren't really on the saddle, but... Yep, yeah, sure. All right, I think I saw a fawny dragon up here. We're going to fight this. That's going to prove... That's not what I wanted. Hello, sir. Hey! -yah. Ow. Ow! Okay. Uh, ow! Ow! That's fine! 
That's a, that's a 174 rock elemental. God damn. Okay, cool. Uh, right, so what we're going to do, we're going to spawn... Do I need to go back home? Did Jim rename my bed? God damn it, Jim. You know what? Where's his base? Tree outpost. I'm going to I'm gonna rename his base over there just real quick. And then we're going to grab Team Crumpets and we're going to go and fight all them gigas. Are these his beds? Good shit. Okay, rename uh, X-Man's beds. And then we can do that on this one as well. X-Man's beds. He's going to be so confused, especially when he dies a lot. Um... Okay, how does one get out of here? Because I need to go die again so I can spawn a home. So I've got my gravestone. Hey! Yeah! Backflip in the air. Cool, I didn't die. <laughs> how did that not kill me? Hello, Mr. Dinosuchus. Look at me. Hey, look at me. Look at me. Why do you not want to eat me? Why does no one want to eat me for? Am I not tasty? Where are you going? Hey, yeah, backflip in the air. Woo! Still not eating me. Come on, then. Oh, no, I don't want Piranha to eat me. I want the croc to eat me. Oh, okay, whatever. Okay, to finish up today, then, we're going to go and fight all these gigas, these Kodontosauruses, just everything around here. Just going to clear the area, kind of start from a nice, clean slate, and then hopefully that gives us some uh, a nice Kodontosaurus for next episode. So we are going to get tea and crumpets out. They should be able to handle this no problem. I say should. I don't think we've ever fought this many in one go. Um, all right, we've all got levels. You just got one level. We can pop that into melee. What do you have? Two levels. We can also pop that into melee. Oh, you know what we could do? Do have the UT as well. But I don't really want to get caught up. Yeah, I don't really want to get caught up in all of this. All right, so we're going to have attack me target. All right, boys, let's go. Oh, make sure you follow me as well. We're going to get him, maybe? I'm trying to whistle attack target. Did we get it? All right, let's go. Hey, yeah. Oh, 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 God. Oh, why can I see damage numbers? Um, oh, there we go. That was weird. We just couldn't see any damage numbers for the longest time. God damn. Are we doing more damage than we used to? Have we always been doing 10,000? It's been a while since we played around with these. We, that seems very, very strong. All right, let's go. God, there's just big stuff everywhere. Here! 12,000, because obviously we've got the imprint on you. God damn, we are not losing to anything. All right, let's fight these now. You got, got that? Whistle one of these? This one? Okay. God, I love these two. Team Crumpets might be up... Wow, we just one-shot that dude. Might be up there with one of my favorite dinos right now. Oh, it's the raid. Okay. It was because he was raging. We can't do any damage to him. I'm not sure why that Giga raged, though, because it was like... He was flying above him. It was weird. Oh, wow. Big knockback. 10,000, 13,000. Yeah, we're pretty unstoppable. 11,000 on you. All right, so we've got one more car chart, and then we've got another Giga. May as well fight this guy just here. All right, let's go. God, like the colors on us and stuff. Wow. All right, boom. I am definitely struggling to hit him sometimes, which is weird. All right, so we've got a Giga and a Karcha. Oh, that's the wrong button axe. Uh, what will we find first? I guess the Giga, because he's coming in. He's coming in. Yeah, I'm, I'm struggling to hit you again. I'm trying to hit you with me tail. He's raging. Wow, I think they did a thousand damage then. God damn. Munch. Munch. Where one of these are 174? Yeah, him. Wow, bye! Why did we launch him? Alright, yeah, go and eat him. Yep. Delicious? Yummy? Good stuff. Alright, one more car char left. Are you a regular one? Yeah. We need you to be a female. We need you to be a good level. Alright. Let's go. I forget which one's team, which one's crumpets. Let's go, team crumpets. Get this car char kill. Oh yeah, you're way better than the paleo ones. Oh yeah. Way better. All right, we've got one more alpha dude. Let's might as well, you know, finish off killing him. Mr. Alpha Connor has no idea what he's in for. But you're going to have to wait a minute because I need some stam. <laughs> uh, we can do level. we got four hearts. We've got some hands. We've got some... <laughs> we've got a bunch of chibis. Good shit. 
All right, let's go. All right. The last five team crumpets today. And we're stuck on each other. Amazing stuff. I'm also going to be stuck on a rock. Okay. Didn't even get to buy and help. There we are then. Boom. So this area is now cleared out. Which means a bunch more giggers. A bunch more car chars. Um, alphas. Other stuff should all respawn here in, in, no, shortly. So we can keep doing that. Come back. Check. Wait until we get a good female. And then... I guess maybe tame another one at some point. Uh, I'll have to be in a good mood to do it. But what we're going to do, we're going to wrap it up. We're going to call it a day there then. So team crumpets, absolutely amazing. We saw baby R throw, was really not that bad. Packs a little bit of a punch, but um, yeah, we can wrap it up. Call it a day. If you enjoyed it, make sure you are whacking a like. Make sure you are subscribing. You ring the bell, never notifications. Follow the social medias. Why are we crouching? Don't crouch. I want us to do a roar. Do a roar for everyone. If you want to support the channel a little bit more and get some extra content, you can become a channel member or Patreon. Thank you very much. I'll catch you in a bit. See you later. Bye.